Hello everyone, good morning, happy Friday. Good morning. Good morning. Good morning, teacher. Thank you, Hope everyone's doing well this morning, TGIF. We're finishing week 11, if you can believe it. Time flies when you're having fun, right? So next week we'll start uh, week 12. And it'll be our last week for uh, for Unit 3. Today we're going to finish our debate. And I want to give you as much time as possible to prepare. I'd like to begin the debates at 9 o'clock. So I want to give us one hour to uh, complete our preparation for the debate. I would take uh, this time, if you haven't already, to watch this video. It's a summary, again, of the debate rules. So if you're asking yourself, well, what makes a good debate? What makes a good debate is what I talk about in the, vi in the video. And so the main thing is to make sure that you keep accurate time. Each team should have a timekeeper keeping track of the time of the opposing team. And if you have to switch duties, right, if you want to take turns uh, maintaining the time, keeping track of the time, that's fine. But make sure that you're keeping track. And then when uh, the time has expired and the person is still speaking, then politely interrupt and say that's, that's it, right? That time is, is transpired. Okay, so um, take a look at the debate rules. And remember that the time to speak when you're doing your uh, debate turns, those are that's the maximum amount of time. If you speak less, I'm not giving you any minimum amount of time to speak. I'm giving you the maximum time to speak. So no more than two minutes when you present your opening claim, your opening argument. Uh, up to no longer than one minute to counter to provide a counter argument right no, no longer than one minute to do the rebuttal right so the time is a very important piece to the debate the entire debate for both teams going back and forth should last about 36 to 37 minutes at the most and it might it might be less right there might be times where um you know if you're not able to uh, to provide an argument or a counter or a rebuttal, um, then that's just a reflection of the quality of the debate, if that makes sense, right? This is, this is your opportunity to provide a good debate. This is what a good debate would look like, having uh, presenting arguments and counter arguments to see who has the best argument, who has the best way of uh, presenting their ideas to support their claims to support their ideas. Remember when you are providing your claim, you need evidence and you need to draw on information coming from outside sources. So this is an exercise also in paraphrasing, taking someone else's idea and using your own words to, um, to express those ideas. All right, so I'm going to go ahead and mute my mic, guys. We'll start uh, our final preparations this morning. Take a look at the video. Jump in and ask questions. If, you're, uh, if you have doubts, send me a chat or just come in and tell me if you want to discuss uh, something with your team. We can do that. But I want to give you this first hour from 8 to 9 to prepare. We'll come back to class at, uh, at 9 o'clock. Um, and and I'll give you I'll ask I'll ask for any final questions and then we'll uh, begin. You're going to record your debates just like you've been recording your online meetings in Microsoft Teams. The only difference now will be that both teams will be in the meeting, so you'll have one meeting. And just to you know keep it simple, I think I would just use your channels for. Yeah, just choose, let's see, you're using, yeah, so your guys are in the same channel, so that's not a problem. So just, yeah, just include one uh, meeting with all eight members, both teams, and make sure you record. Try to use your, your uh, video 
when you're speaking, right? And if broadband is not a problem, then feel free to keep the video on the whole time. But at least try to have the video on when you're when you're speaking, whether it's the initial claim or the counterclaim or the rebuttal or the opening statements. Okay, and make sure that you choose uh, a member of your team to do the opening statement, maybe one person for the opening statement, another person for the closing statement. So, you know, one person will probably have to uh, do an opening statement and one of the claims, okay? But you choose as a team which person you think is the best suited for that role. All right, so are there any questions, guys, as we get into our final preparations? All right, guys, well, I'll go ahead and mute my mic. Go ahead and continue now with your groups, and we'll come back at 9 o'clock. Okay, teacher. Okay, teacher, thank you. All right, guys, um, to finalize today's uh, class, I want to give you time for doing the debate and just want to make sure there are no more questions about how to do it. If you have some classmates who are um, not in class today or having problems connecting, um, the, the idea was to try to do this today in class. If you want to rearrange or reschedule it, with your uh, with if, if everyone is in agreement with rescheduling it at a later time, that's fine. But I really wanted to give everyone today in class to complete this uh, task. So um, I would try to go ahead and do it, even if you don't have all of your team members uh, in uh, in class with you today, so that you can complete this preferably in class, right? Um, so. Uh, let's let's go ahead and uh, begin doing the debate. Does anyone have any questions about doing the uh, doing the debate? Yes, teacher me. Uh huh. Go uh, ahead. My question is like, for example, uh, my team um, is going to start saying like our points. I don't know how to say that in English. Like uh -huh. así, corridos. O va a ser como nosotros decimos uno, luego el equipo nos refuta y así como uno y uno. Okay, did uh, did you watch the video this morning? No. Okay. Uh, I explained in the video that uh, let me show you my screen, and I, I'll go over this briefly because I the intention with the video guys was for you to watch the video first where I explain exactly how how to do this debate but the way to do it here is um let me open up here there are basically 12 steps in completing the debate the first and i've numbered them here you're going to begin with the opening statement for the pro or for the four team right the person the team that is for the argument then the opening statement for the opposing team. That's number two. Point number two. Then the third step, the first reason for the four team, and that's going to be the debate turn, the original claim, the counterclaim, and the rebuttal. The fourth step will be the first reason for the team that's against. And then point number four, Five or step number five, the second reason for the four, then the second reason for the against, then the third reason yeah. for the four, then the third reason for the against, until you finish with the fourth reason. And then the closing statement for the four, and then the closing statement for the against. All right, so okay. that's the idea yeah. for uh, doing the debate, the order, and keeping very close, um, you know, being careful with the time. Yeah. All right. Yeah, I was thinking that it was going to be like that, but another classmate from the other team was asking me, and I, I got confused, and I was like, oh, let me ask him. Yeah, no, that's fine. That's fine, I, and that's why I wanted to meet with you guys one last time to answer or clarify any questions that you have. So, um 
but but do make sure that you watch the video if if it's if you haven't already um but go ahead and try to record and do your debate and you know if you have a team member that's not there then someone will have to to cover for that person okay we have a lot of activities in this class um and that's on purpose right that's my intention so that you know if you're if you're not able to participate in every single activity right it's not going to drastically affect your your grade but uh it's important obviously to try to participate as much as possible so the debate this is our first debate and i understand that but there are a lot of rules that you may not be familiar with and so part of this activity is trying to stick to those rules the time frame and also um just doing your best and to paraphrase other people's ideas all right any other questions guys thank you teacher you're welcome any other questions all right um we'll go ahead and stop there i'm not going to have a closing uh comments at 9 40 okay so this will be uh the last i'll be online to answer questions but uh, i'll let you guys work up until you, however long you need to work uh today to complete this task and again if you want to reschedule if everybody agrees both teams uh to agree to do it later that's fine also but that's between you and your teammates all right Okay, so again, we will not come back at 940. So if you're in your session, just keep working. And um, we'll, uh, we'll see everybody on, on Monday. Okay? okay All right, thanks, guys. Teacher. And uh, I look forward teacher. to seeing your debates. Teacher. Yes. Hi, teacher. Um, can we um, have a little call on the next session? De 10 a 11, bueno, o sea, solo para hablarle de ciertas cosas. Uh, with me? Yes. Sure. Mm -hmm. Okay. Yep. Teacher, sir, we are not going to do the debate today? Uh, no, we are. We're going to do the debate today. We're going to start right now doing the debate. Nada más estoy diciendo en caso que hay uh, compañeros... Que no, están, este, que no están actualmente en, hoy en la clase, ustedes pueden decidir entre ustedes si quieren participar ahorita sin esta persona o con todos puede programar después, pero es entre ustedes. Pero yo prefiero que todos lo, lo hacen ahorita en clase. Esa es la, la preferencia. Sí. sí. Yes. Pues no sé qué digan mis compañeros. Yo digo que está bien hacerlo ahorita. Uh -huh. Yo prefiero eso. Les digo, como hay un montón de actividades, lo que estamos haciendo cada semana, eh, eh, la verdad no va a afectar mucho si, si, si no van a participar en una de estas. Es, pero, y esa es la, la razón, porque yo entiendo a veces no pueden entrar, no pueden participar. Claro que yo quiero que todos están participando en todas las actividades, pero, pero bueno, la idea con este debate es que todos participen ahorita en clase. Esa, es, esa fue la intención. Entonces, si no, eh, no, si no están uno de sus compañeros, pues alguien, pues hay que tomar dos razones. Hay que, pues este, pero, pero no va a afectar nada más. But it's not going to affect your grade, though, those who are participating today in class, right? Um, but yeah, again, I, I really would want everybody to participate and complete the debate today in class, okay, if, if possible. Okay. Teacher. All right. Any other questions? <laughs> no. All right. All right. So, all right. So, it's okay. What's that? I'm nervous. Ah, you're nervous. Don't be nervous. I know this is the first time. Just do your best. Do your best and try to stick to the times because the times are pretty short. Just talking one or two minutes. Um, just do the best you can and we'll... Um, I understand this is the first time and we'll probably do this again, another debate on a different topic later. But yeah, just uh, go for it. 
Don't be afraid to, to make mistakes. And um, this is the same idea as all of uh, our participating um, activities where it's conversational. Don't worry about making mistakes. It's the main thing is that you're creating the language. That's, that's what this is about, right? So don't worry about making mistakes. Just try to get your ideas out. It's not about your grammar. It's about trying to understand the message that you're trying to say. So just keep that in mind is how am I, how can I share this message so that someone can understand it? That's your objective here. Okay. So don't worry about how fast or how slow you're speaking, or if you make mistakes, or if you have to start over, don't worry about that. Just keep, just try to keep the, the ideas flowing, right? In, in, in your debate and try to keep and use up the time that you have. If you have two minutes, try to use up those two minutes. If you have one minute, try to use up that one minute. Okay. All right. Okay, guys, good luck. And um, if I don't talk to you beforehand, I'll see you guys on Monday. See you, All right, Bye. good luck. See you, Bye. Thank you. Bye.